Hi, this is Georgia from Creative Moments by G. So happy you could join us today. Today's a little different. We are going to make some alternative cards with the Kerchief Card Kit. So I hope you enjoy this. The Kerchief Card Kit comes with eight cards that you can make and it has the envelopes and of course it has some punch outs. So let me show you what that card kit looks like before we show you the cards that we made. So here is what the card kit looks like. As you can see we have envelopes that come with it. We have the card bases, two different colors. You have some vellum that comes in it. You have some punch out roses, you have four of those, and then you have some gold leaves and some twine that also comes with it. Now some people are taking the envelopes and they're cutting them up and they're turning them into card bases, which of course gives you more cards if you want. But we decided not to do that, so we just cut these card bases apart. So that gave us, instead of four, it gave us eight of the red, and then we cut the blue apart and that gave us eight card bases. So we're going to show you 16 variations of the cards that we made and they turned out so pretty. Now do you remember what's special about this kerchief card kit? It's special because if you order from this mini catalog at least $50, you get to order something from this catalog for free. And the kerchief card kit is free if you have ordered $50. So I hope you head over to my website, creativemomentsbyg.com. Click on um, shop, right? And then it'll take you right to, right to my website and you can order something for $50. That's not hard to do. And then you can order this for free. So let's get started. <clears throat> the first card that we made was this one and look how we did it. We cut it diagonally. Now remember, we added our own card bases and so we just cut your normal A2 card which is five and a half by four and a quarter. We just cut that and then we just put this diagonally and we cut it diagonally and we used the pretty peacock cardstock and our rose that came with the kit. This is their card base and then we used the sentiment sending positive thoughts and feel good wishes. Now let me show you the sentiments that we used. We used stamps sets from So Sentimental, Painted Poppies, Heartfelt, this is the one that I just showed you, Positive Thoughts. We also used sentiments from Seriously the Best and Heart to Heart. So, there you go. And then we used, oh, I've talked about this many, many times. I love, love this cutout, right? And this die set is from Painted Labels Dies. So, those are the additional sets we used because we really like the sentiments. Okay, moving on to another one that we made. And on this sentiment, we put our hearts are meant to be together. We have this card base, remember, that we cut in two. We have the vellum that, that came from the card kit and then the beautiful gold leaves. Now these leaves are not, they don't have sticky on them. So you have to either use glue dots or wet glue to uh, glue them down to your card. And then we set this up on dimensionals. Isn't that beautiful? So pretty. So that's another one that we used. <clears throat> now we took one of the red kerchief base cards and we cut that and added it to a base card, right? And then we just put a band around. And on this band, I believe it's, um, it's Cherry Cobbler. And then we used one of our punches and we punched it and then split it in the cherry cobbler to give us a little base. We put it up on dimensionals. Isn't that beautiful? So pretty. And any one of these designs, you could say, well, I'm just going to make the same design. You could do that if you wanted to. Our next one we made super easy. We just took a stamp. We glued this on a card base and we just stamped in the middle. Just a quick card, your friendship is a blessing. 
And then we stamp some little flowers here and put, you make my life better. Isn't that beautiful? Just a very quick card if you need some friendship cards. Very fast. Next, we took this beautiful cutout that I told you about and we put it behind, just punched, we just punched out this sentiment. I can't thank you enough. Added the gold leaves that come with the kit, the vellum that comes with the kit. We put this kerchief on top of a base card, and there we have it. Isn't that pretty? Okay. Next, we took a little bit different take on it. We have the solid part of the card, right? We put that down as a mat, and then we just took a white piece of paper, and we just stamped some leaves on it. We put our two roses that came with the card kit. This also came with the card kit. And then we put the roses up on dimensionals. And there we have it. Beautiful thinking of you. Very quick. Next, I'm going to take this one. We decided to make a fun fold. Isn't that cute? So we took our solid card that we cut apart from the kit. And then we just added some old olive, a blank one. We put some butterflies from one of our sentiment stamp sets. This also came from the same sentiment, hugs, prayers, and love. And then this came from a six by six cardstock paper that we bought. So any of these, if you wanted to buy them so that you could get the free kerchief card kit, would qualify you for that free kit. So we have that one. Next, I'm going to take, we decided to make a band card. These leaves also come in the kit. Aren't they beautiful? Once again, we used our punch, punched it out. We simply made a band, right? And then we used our solid piece that came from the kit, and we stamped some flowers, and we just made a gatefold. So here we have a gatefold, and we added a band. So, so pretty. I just love, I think band cards are some of my favorites. So we have that. Next, we have another diagonal card. What we did, we took the solid color from the card kit, and then we ran it through a die. We embossed it with one of our new embossing. Isn't that beautiful? Then we just put a strip here. This is from one of the six by six cardstocks. We stamped thanks. And then look what we did to the inside. We stamped it and we put just a little topping right there. Isn't that pretty? Just created a beautiful card. So many ideas, right? Next, we took another diagonal and we just took the solid paper from the kit. This also came from the kit. The rose came from the kit. We put it up on dimensionals, and we just made our little message right there. Isn't that pretty? And then you can just write on the inside. So pretty. It looks like a diagonal cut card, but it's not. It's just on the front. So we'll put that right there. Next, we have this beautiful one. We used the blue-green kerchief card. We just cut out a little band to go around the front. We used the blue that came from the kit. We stamped on a white piece of paper some butterflies and added hugs, prayers, loves, and some rhinestone. Isn't it pretty? Oh, so beautiful. Really, we started and we were a little concerned about the colors, but oh, they turned out so pretty. Once again, here's just, we took the solid piece we ran it through an embossing folder. We punched out a circle and another circle and just stamped hello friend. Once again, we used our cardstock that comes in the six by six pack, so pretty. And then we just stamped, I miss you a lot because the front says, hello friend, I miss you a lot. Isn't that lovely? Next, very simple card. We took our the base that we cut apart, our card, our kerchief card, we just cut it in half, cut a little bit of it out, glued it down on a card base, and stamped it, and used stamps on the end. Isn't it pretty? So pretty. 
Next, we took the red kerchief, we used our vellum, we used our gold leaves, we punched out a saying, we added it on dimensionals, and then we just embossed sending healing hugs. Isn't that pretty? It just turned out so pretty. So pretty. I'm going to put this one right here. Next, we have another one that looks kind of like the blue one. But we added, now you get this string in the card kit. So we added that. We just made a little bow, did the same style, added our thought right there. So pretty. But that little bow just adds to it, doesn't it? Put him right there. Let's see if we can get him. Let's see. We'll put him down here. Okay, and finally, of course, we did one more band card. I just love it. Now, this is from that card stock I'm talking about, and I'll have that in the supplies so you know where to get it. It's six by six, and it's so beautiful. It has flowers on one side. I think it's uh, dressed, something dressed. Anyway, it has lipstick and perfume on the other side and shoes, but the side I like is the one with all the flowers. So we just made this beautiful band. And when you open it up, wishing you much happiness today and always. Isn't that beautiful? And we used our leaves from the uh, card kit. And let's see, let's get that on there. So we have our leaves from the card kit. We also have a strip of this piece of paper, the solid piece of paper from, from the card kit. Now, remember, the card kit also comes with all these envelopes. So you have eight envelopes, has matching little colors here. So you would just need to add eight more envelopes. Okay. Well, thank you so much for sharing your time with me today. I think you're really going to love this card kit. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. We would really appreciate that. Thank you so much. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, we would love to have you as a subscriber. If you need more information about joining our Sunflower Stamper group, oh my goodness, just private message me, Facebook me, get a hold of me and I would love to talk to you about it. So go out and have a fantastic day. Be creative in your crafting and I'll see you in the next video.